Hi, this is me, Tom Bonnes, continuing with our Block Fortress series tutorial videos. So, uh, I'm going to load up my white mineral base. Now, I'm trying out something a little bit new today. Um, what I've done is I've set the base up already to go. So, first off, what I've done is, as you can see, I've got um, some of these, what are they, 50 cows, I think. Yeah, 50 caliber guns on the top there. They are so-so. Um, but then... What I've also done, I've built this kind of upper wall level um, because you're kind of limited on the size of your base as to the number of the guns you can have around it. So I thought I would try bringing in um, some more ones. So I've built these towers up and kind of built this area around the back. I haven't actually got a lot of guns in it yet because I've run out of minerals. Um, but I thought I would try that out. Um, I also put this tower in a couple of um, a couple of goes ago just to have somewhere high up to stand to keep an eye out for the ninjas. Um, and then I'm trying out some of the landmines today. First time using them, so a little bit excited about that. Um, and my block walls, sorry, not my block walls, the um, bait blocks, I've got those um, kind of all together running up there like so, big pile of them there and pretty much all over the place. Um, sorry about my voice by the way, it's a bit croaky. Um, I've been had a bit of flu recently, um, but let's not that not let that worry us and let's try and be on the top here. Let's start this and let's see what happens. I don't think we've really had um, many new guys come in. Um, this guy here, I'm sure, actually might be new. I think he's just kind of like a general sort of dude. Keeping an eye out for the ninjas as well, because those are the ones that are the problem. I want to run down and grab some of that money. I'm finding that I'm ending up with loads of money and not as much minerals. Oh, these guys come in and they, they destroy your blocks really, really quickly. Um, they literally just, just whack straight through them. Um, so it's good to take them out a lot. Take them out quickly, sorry. I haven't had a major problem with them. I think I've been quite quite lucky with my guns taking them out quickly. I kind of want to see if anyone's coming over towards where the mines are. It'd be nice to see them exploding. I put them all really close together. And what happens if I walk on them? Um, I'm not going to check it. <laughs> while I'm here. Yeah, I think the next upgrades I'm going to be doing as well, um, I'm actually going to be looking to um, set up my um, uh, my mine shafts so that they are self-powered and also I get my money back when I um, decide to remove them. Um, that way I'll be able to put mine shafts all over the map and kind of just move them around after each go. Um, which I think is the way to do it. Uh, what are you doing? Level complete. We lost one block. Um, we're legends. <laughs> Yeah, mined 55. And that's strange that we've only mined 55. That must mean that one of our mining shafts um, has com depleted all of the mines in there already, or all of the minerals in there already. So I hadn't noticed that going down, actually. I hadn't been checking it for a while. Um, oh, dear. Not sure exactly where that is. So that is going to be a slight problem. I've um, got three of the white minerals. Um, so that's good. I need to get up. I'm trying to collect these minerals as quick as possible now because I want to get these upgrades done on the mine shafts. That would have really helped us if we'd already done it because we could just, you know, like, like at the moment they're coming from the north and the south. We could literally just go over to some of these mine shafts here, plonk a mine shaft there, um, plonk a mine shaft there, 
and, and those ones would probably be quite safe um, from attack and we can just leave them undefended and then you know move them for the next go depending on where they're coming from um, oh, I'm quite annoyed about that mine minerals 93 that's not even a lot of guns we could be in a bit of trouble for the next round but we'll see how it goes thank you for watching this one um, and catch you for the next one thanks bye